Okay, let's skip. Skip, skip, skip. And then we will be brought back well to where we found the vestige for our memory. So we're back at the cathedral, basically, and we're going to be completing like the short, um, short segment of that, including a boss battle. And then there's a revelation at the end with regards to Louis's uh, sister and stuff like that. So once we get back here, we're once again wearing a different veil, so blood veil. So let's re-equip this one because it's fortified and also because it's my favorite so yeah i should have in retrospect i should have touched the this missile first in the previous um episode before i actually went and said goodbye just so we could have saved what is that? but yeah this is like a really short segment now i think if i could just remember like the quickest way to get through it and also not be such a noob fighting these enemies okay I don't think we need to go up I don't okay sweep. oh my gosh oh my gosh oh freaking stop it Okay, let's try going this direction. Like, I'm hoping I could still remember. Uh, but yeah, anyways, I will be... I will be, um... Releasing those uh, videos because I can now play I can now actually play my Nintendo switch again So I will be releasing switch videos uh, Once again, and I have quite a number of those planned. Okay, let's go down here first um, and also I have a couple of so my gosh I have a couple of Switch games, uh, not Switch games, actually uh, games on the, on, on the Microsoft Xbox that I also would like to play. Just making sure. Just making sure. Okay. And open this one. Oh, ornate key. I knew I was forgetting something. Okay, go up here, I think. Okay, down here. Oh my god, I like totally forgot what I need to do. Oh my goodness. I have been playing other games. It's actually been, I think, two days since I've played this last, so I feel like I'm suddenly... I'm suddenly losing my ability to play this game and also memory regarding where to go how to get there at least when it comes to this area um the other areas i can still remember them I see something there. so yeah that's a vestige Oh, sweet, 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 sweet goodness. Oh, my Mia. Oh, Mamma Mia. <laughs> I can hear the enemy walking upstairs. Um, so head here, then right. Drop down here and also tell yourself several times how much you hate this area <laughs> because you certainly do. You certainly do. We certainly do here uh, hate this area. Um, oh, I thought there was. 
never mind. Never the mind. Never the mind. This is where we need to go. I'm looking for the path. The other path. Because we made a beeline. <laughs> Here. I'll probably cut this down because this is just so much backtracking and I'm supposed to like cut this really short or make try to make this as short as possible. But yeah, I hate this area so much. I was looking at something. Because I keep thinking that I should hurry up and instead I end up making the game long Okay, you know what? Deal with that Io. I think you can deal with that as I... Shoddy key. We need the ornate key, right? It's a key. Regardless, it is a key. Oh my goodness, here. <laughs> oh my goodness, oh my goodness. <laughs> that was not the way to go. Oh yeah, I, I haven't... Ah, oh, good grief. This area. This area is giving me grief. So much grief. I need to backtrack just to make sure that we are going to the right in or in the right direction. Okay, so that enemy's gonna drop down. Let it drop down. So you can do a back attack on it. But yeah, we're basically going the right way. <gasps> Frick! <laughs> sweet, sweet Jeebus! Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness. Like, it, it wouldn't have been that bad since we will essentially be respawning right next to where the uh, missile was. But holy crap. Um, not here. I, believe we can climb that. I would not want to go through the enemies again. <laughs> oh wait, we are going the right way. We just needed to go up. We just needed to go up. Then down here. You know what? Let's let's be careful. Let's not go diving head first down whatever path we can find. If one of us were to fall okay, here. not there. Definitely. Definitely. Did we already go up here? I think we already went up here. I feel like we already went up here. Uh but just to be safe. Because I have totally forgotten where we were. Oh yeah, we've already been here. I have totally forgotten where we are supposed to go. Um, go here. Then go here. Okay, that. Then this door. Then through this door. And then let's try the key here. Yeah, or Nikki, we have the shoddy key that I have. I like I think this is um a different path than the one I initially took when I was speed running through the area, so I'm a little bit lost 
I remember taking this route. Holy crap. Holy crap, dude. Uh, but we will eventually find it, find the area that we're supposed to be going towards. Okay, up here. Oh, here it is. Oh my gosh, we just needed to go up the stairs that we've been running around in. But yeah, we have the option of actually dropping down there to get the vestige, but it's not a vestige that I would necessarily want to get. So I was- No! You're not going to make me fall. So I'm not gonna go drop down there. Um, yeah, we're not dropping down there, we're, we're actually taking the path that will lead us to uh, the next area. But I am... getting <laughs> a tomato sandwich. I am feeling hungry, so I needed a tomato sandwich. Um, go up here. Let's go here. It's much closer. And this one will give us the key. Oh, no, or not. What? I was pretty sure that was the key. Or maybe it's somewhere here. I know an enemy is gonna drop you the key. Oh, the enemy that's gonna drop the key is the one that is being guarded like in a circular room and it has a lot of windows that much I remember I remember now okay let's heal up <laughs> like all the paths are now just converging into my head and making me so confused as to where I'm supposed to go so I'm really sorry about that um, but yeah we're getting close to the end at the very least or the end of this area at the very least um, grab this pull this down, so we have a shortcut. Yeah. That was such a long about way of doing things. Oh my god. You should have been focused on Io, not me. Oh my- Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness, I just wanted to do a back attack. I just wanted to do a back attack, and I know I'm doing such a bad job. I'm doing such a bad job in this episode. But I just... I just wanted... I just wanted to do a back attack. That's all I ever wanted. Back attacks are cool, after all. They're super cool. Are you serious? Let's get this. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Well, let's heal. Okay, and this is the chest from earlier on, or the ornate key. Oh, finally, we found the door. Uh, Jesus, oh, what the frick? That took way too long. That took way too long. Okay, grab the missile and also heal because we're running out of regen factors. So we need we actually need to heal. 
But yeah, we're basically nearing the end. That is where the boss battle is going to be. And since we didn't pick up any um, of the uh, memories or most of the memories, and since we are not going to revive. So the thing is, if you talk to this Io lookalike here, um, she will give you the option to restore the vestiges. Now, to get the like the perfect true ending, you have to like restore every single vestige, especially of the successors and also of Io. That will give you the true ending. If you want to get the good ending, then all you had to do is like restore all of the vestiges of the successors, but do not restore Io's. Um, to get the bad end, bad ending, you don't restore any vestiges, any memories at all. And then the ending that we are going for is restoring uh, one uh, memory. And the memory I actually decided is is um, Mia's brother. The memory for Mia's brother, because Mia's brother ended up uh, being a um, a successor. But anyway, let's uh, push forward. And beat the cathedral's cathedral's boss, so we can make sure that we never have to go back here again, except to open uh, the doors, the two doors that will lead to um, that will lead to the two areas that we will need to go to later. So that's uh, the first phase of the battle. Basically, for that phase. Um, what I did in my initial playthrough was just hide behind the walls while I push forward. So same should also go, oh my freaking lord, uh, to this. Okay. That's gonna explode. Now, the cutscenes that occur during the end of these battles... Pause. Let's do Bring this. it any time! Let's fly! Back to business. Battles, like uh, as we traverse the memories and as we meet with the successors prior to them being corrupted, they're actually pretty sad cutscenes. And those cutscenes would really want you to uh, make the effort of restoring the vestiges. Now, you will be given an option at the end of this to, like, at the end of those sort of mindscape uh, scenarios, if you want to. Um, revive you know restore the memories and since we don't have any of the vestiges we don't have that option so we just simply walk to the door um so another i think there's two more cutscenes to end uh this area but uh to complete it to complete the cathedral area we have to go through the door um which will appear once we finish this very long loading screen um, through the door and then the revelation regarding Louis' uh, 
brother. So we got the ribcage vestige. Um, the parts of the uh, successors, uh, the parts of Queen, basically, that the successors are holding, those cores you can only get if you don't revive them. So if you want to get all of the cores, then you would really need to do more than one playthrough because you can't get them. You can't get them by just doing a single one. Unless, of course, well, not even if you go for the bad ending, you will still need to go through the good ending to get the two cores that you can only go uh, get through that uh, route. But basically, that is um, another successor, and that is that one. That that girl there is Louis. Louis' uh, si uh, sister. Yeah. So we go back up, and another cutscene is gonna trigger, and. We're gonna skip that one as well, but uh, to cap off, cap off this episode, I just want to head towards a missile, which will appear after after this cutscene. So we'll just skip that. Jack is gonna attack us. Basically, it's it's the opening cutscene. It's or the opening movie song. You know, yeah. But as I was saying. This is as far as we are going go going to go for today. For the next episode, we will be tackling uh, the Fion um, area or the snowy area. And if I can squeeze through, because we are going to try and get... We are going... We're not going to try. We actually certainly must with 100% certainty get all of the vestiges in that area. Uh, but if we can squeeze one more area, then we are going to... I think the next one would be the Sandy place. I kind of forgot uh, its name at the moment. But anyway, this is as far as we are going to go today. Thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you all in the next episode. Until then, you guys know the drill. Dream on, fly on. Bye-bye for now. Keep safe, everyone. Different things for you.